Did USAID fund coronavirus research in Wuhan, China? We did not fund gain of function research. That's not the as question. You know. The question is did you fund coronavirus research in Wuhan, China? Before my time, there was the PREDICT program with which you're familiar, which ended in China in 2019. Yeah, this is a $200 million program, and the GAO has also identified that some of these grants went directly to the Wuhan Institute of Virology, where there is a suspicion that the lab leak began that began the pandemic. Um, has USAID awarded funds to the Academy of Military Medical Sciences in China? I, not to my knowledge, but I'd have to give I think the answer is once again yes. GAO has found that there have been subawards of NIH money as probably as well as USAID money that went to the Academy of not just medical research, military medical research in China. Now, part of the unknowns here is we can't get the records to look at this. So I've been asking for months and months for records. In September of last year, I wrote Ms. Powers, the USAID, a request asking for records from the PREDICT program. These are not classified. These are simply records of scientific research. And we want to read the grants to find out what they were doing and whether the research was dangerous or not. Um, the response I got from your agency was, USAID will not be providing any documents at this time. They're just unwilling to give documents on scientific grant proposal. We're paying for it. They're asking for $745 million more in money, and we get no response. So two weeks ago, the ranking member, uh, Rish, myself, and 25 other Republican senators, unfortunately, so far, signed a letter once again. They've, it's still no response. We're not asking for classified information. We're not asking for anything unusual. Um, 20 million people died around the world. You're supposed to be an agency that cares about the death of people around the world. We, you know, talk about starvation and famine, and 20 million people died from a virus, and you won't give us the basic information about what grants you're funding around the world and who you're funding. Should we be funding the Academy of Military Medical Research in China? They're now off limits. But did we fund them? And who was making the decision? You know who ran the PREDICT program? UC Davis. Have you had any conversations with UC Davis about research in China and whether it was advisable? So again, to set the record straight, first of all, the PREDICT program ended in 2019. Um, we have people And yet it goes on in other forums and other names. That, that's certainly well, not USAID program. Well, you have, go, you have go, a program go, called forward. Emergency Pandemic Threats Program still, don't you? If I could just, just finish in response to the first set of allegations, um, 